won't close anymore. It's broken. It's a little ripped. Uh, yeah, it's just trash. Put the little boot down while in a uh, park or any of them. And there's gonna be this little, uh, this little piece. It's gonna be right here. Um, just pull it out by this little thing right here. And um, after that, you should be able to just pull it out. Um, you don't need to take out these screws right here. All you gotta do is just pull up, slides right out. And you gotta take off these two last screws. That one that's a little unscrewed. And that bottom one, uh, the two bottom ones. Uh, this one. That one. Um, this one. Now that you have those two out, you can just uh, pull up. Should come right out. Just uh, unplug this right here on the bottom. You're good. Uh, these are a little hard. You just, uh, you can see, just press a button right here. Sorry, it's all messy, but put this button right here. And you just, uh, it's kind of tough, but. You might have to use a, a screwdriver or something because it's like this. Got the old one out now. Old one. Connected everything on the new one. Just uh, pop it back into place. All right, so it popped into place uh, pretty easily. As you can see, it looks a lot cleaner. The cup holder actually closes on this one, and it came with this little piece right here. Uh, I didn't have that before, so all you gotta do now is just just put those screws back in, and uh, it should be secured. Uh, go ahead and do that now. If you unplug the wires, uh, plug all this back in. Got it in neutral. I'll just pop it back in. Shift knob in. It's a little piece. All right. Uh, let's put it like that. And this should just clip back on. There we go. It's a finished product. It did come a little damaged, but I mean, it was the best one I could find. This still works. Looks a whole lot better than the old broken one. Don't forget to put this thing back on right here. I got this little, little cool little tray now. Leave a like if this helped. Leave a comment down below. And thank you guys for watching.